everybody, this is Super Regan, also known as Regan, and Minecraft 1.1 is out today. I hope you guys like the new thing. They fix some bugs and glitches. So what I'll be doing today is, so you guys know of a lot of survival shows I've been working on, but the point is that they are not really detailed on how to play Minecraft and how to collect wood and all that stuff. So this is a how-to series. So as you can see, after you purchase Minecraft, you'll get this game. Doesn't look like much, but it's truly awesome. Head over to single player, create a new world. I'll name it, um, I don't know. This is a, I don't know what the name of this will be. I'll put it in the title. Um, I'll just call it for today, how to play Minecraft. And then, this is the game mode. You can change it to survival or creative or hardcore. Um, I'm going to head over to more world options. You could type in any seed, but I'm just going to leave it like that to make it uh, cooler, challenging. So as you can see, it's generating the world. Make sure you have a good computer to run Minecraft on or else it'll be laggy. So as the world generates, it'll you'll suffer a little lag, but for me, I have a really nice computer. Not suffering that much lag, well, not much lag at all. So if it's lagging too much for you guys, press escape, press options, video changing, video settings, and change your render distance to short or tiny. So, um, okay, head. so I'll teach you guys the control. Move the mouse around to move the view around. Um, you might be familiar with PC games. You use W, A, S, and D to move around. Get used to that. Do some parkouring. Jump over stuff. And so the mouse keys. Um, you have to left click and hold on a block while it's like highlighted. You can see the little black lines around it when you point at it. That's to destroy things, and right click is to interact with things or place blocks. So in the beginning, we have to start out by punching trees. You just head over to a tree like this, hold down left click, and you'll get a block. You have to move around to collect that. I just got an achievement, and you'll have to collect as much wood as you possibly can. So, hold on. So, yeah, um... Uh, so, yeah, uh, if you haven't seen my videos, I have a bunch of duo commentaries. We use those during Skype. It's really fun. Um, this is Minecraft 1.1. 1.0 was pretty exciting. I got Minecraft around 1.7.3. So, as you can see, I have six wood planks. It says down here in the hot bar. Here are the hearts, and here's your food. To go into this mode, I just showed you hit E. As you can see, I am a slime, which is a monster. You'll find it in the deep, but it's very rare, and he has earphones. You can go to Minecraft.net to customize it. So put it in here, then take all these wooden planks, then right click on each square, and you'll create a crafting table. So what we need to do with that crafting table is place it down wherever your mind desires. I don't really care. Nobody else cares either. Just place it down. Then here's where you can craft serious items, like craft like a boss. So right click these wooden planks, I mean left click them, and put two on top of each other and you'll get some sticks. Take two sticks and make a pick by putting the blade here. This is a very important crafting. You'll use it hundreds of times, I promise you. And take that. As you can see, there's a cup. There's a nice little chicken over there. So let's start digging. Hold your mouse at the ground and smash some dirt. Just like you smash the cheese. And you'll get smashing. So our goal right now is to collect some cobblestone. If you don't know what that is, it's what you get from mining stone. Yeah, and don't try punching trees in real life, guys. It's not really good. So as you can see, there is um, stone with this sto strange stone. This is coal. You have to pick that up, and you can make torches with it. So I just made a staircase. You can dig a hole if you want. Then just 
use the pickaxe to smash the stone and you can pick up the cobblestone which is not stone and it's a nice building material there's also fire in this game which destroys wood and cobblestones a pretty durable material hard to destroy by hand so what you want to do is you want to keep smashing these blocks until you pick up around 20 of these 20 cobble 20 cobble gobble gobble so I'm just collecting some coal and I'll mine three more of these and there we go so after you have 20 we'll head up and craft a bit more so I'm just going to punch a tree use the correct tools to punch the correct thing or else you will lose durability durability so yes the tools have durability in this game and as you can see my wood pick has a little bar on it that's how much it has worn so each each one of these will give you four planks so I think this is enough you take all of these and you have 35 wood planks that should be a lot so I'm just make a lot of sticks um let's good to make a lot of sticks because you can use them a lot so what I'm going to do is make a shovel it's like a pickaxe but it only has one blade as you can see you're kind of like drawing out the items you want we don't need the wood pick we'll make a stone one we need to make a pick use the cobblestone to do that and then you need to make an axe to chop down the trees it's kind of like half of this but that'll make a hole we don't want that so we place a block down here and get an, ourselves a nice axe. So to make um, a sword, here's the handle. Here's the blade. You can use that to hunt. Interesting. So we also want to make a furnace. You put cobblestone in every square but the middle. And you'll get this nifty furnace over here. So right now I'm just going to explore the forest see what I can get. Just, as you can see, the axe is chopping through these trees much quicker, and that's really cool. So I'm just going to hunt some cows. Sorry cows, but I'm hungry. Really sorry. Sorry. And then you'll either get raw beef or leather. You can use leather to craft armor, saddles, and some good stuff. An apple? Really? Oh yes, um, so I think part of the new update is that trees might drop apples. So we have an apple and that's pretty cool. I never thought that the update just came out today. So if any of you guys are watching, see that apple that was pretty sweet. Here are some wolves. You can tame them if you have a bone, but I don't have one right now. So I'm just going to walk through the forest like nothing ever happened. So here's some chickens. Take them as chickens. Sorry, sorry, sorry. But, uh, slime's gotta do what a slime's gotta do. So after we have those chickens, we have a nice dinner to cook. And we have to search the land for some sheep. Sheep might not be common in your spawn, but I will do my best to find some. As you can see, you can jump on trees and parkour, it's fun. And if you double tap W, you can, you can sprint if you double tap W. And that's another nifty thing recently added to Minecraft. Minecraft is, has like updates every week. It's like breaking my mods and all that. The apple is pretty cool. I have an apple. I don't know what to do with it. That's pretty sick. I got an apple, man. I feel like a As you can see, this is a ravine. I don't want to go exploring because I'll probably die, but there is some stuff to mine in there. And, but it will be very dangerous to mine in there. Um, I'm just going to head back here and look for sheep my quest so here's a cave entrance we don't want to really enter caves on the first day we're unprepared not much armor our weaponry system isn't that advanced 
You can make bows and weapons in Minecraft later on. And yes, monsters come out. That's why I have a sword. So I'm just going to check the mode. Oh yeah, it's not a normal. So we just need to find sheep. You'll usually find sheep in plains like this with a ton of tall grass, which is that stuff. So we'll have to adventure in here and find ourselves. Oh, here we go. I can see some over there. You can use shears to gently take the wool off a sheep. Or you can slay the sheep, which I don't really want to do. But it's the first day we don't have iron, and I'm really sorry, sheep. I'm really sorry for that. So we just aim our sword at the sheep, and... I only need three wool, I don't want to kill a lot of sheep, I don't, and I don't need that much wool. I need some cows to give me more leather, which I'm going to use for armor, which will help stop damage from monsters. Those are cows. Okay. I think that's enough. Hello, sheep. You're my friend. Okay, I has an apple. There's some stone over here. Um, it seems like something suspicious. No, maybe not. No, nothing suspicious. Just some rocks. Um, I guess that's cool. So right now I'm just going to get some wood from these trees. Wood is all. Wood is always important, you need it for the handles of your weapons, and later in Minecraft, you might set a little place, chop down all the trees, and you'll have no more wood left. So, I'm going to choose a spot for a house. Um, I guess I'll choose it right here, but I have to clear out the trees first. getting dark it's getting dark so I'm going to have to make a hidey hole if you don't know what that is it's a hole you hide in very simple to make okay you can either dig down or dig up I'm going to dig down because I don't see any mountains or anything like that so just dig yourself a hole now we make some torches you need some sticks about three sticks and some coal on top of that and you get all these torches very cool Coolio. Now I'm just going to cover myself up in this hole so no monsters can drop down and attack me. I'm just going to dig out a small little cave here for a nice base of operations. B O S base of no B O O boo base of base of operations. <laughs> 